Hi everyone! Today is the official launch of the Pinnacle CPA Review app. We are proud to say that this is the very first CPA Review app in the Philippines. We have been working very hard on this for more than a year now and I'm very excited to show to you the functionalities and how powerful this application is. By the way, differential sa online review natin. The online review is for those who are reviewing for the CPA licensure examination. Basically, video lessons yun na available sa website natin covering all topics in the board exam. On the other hand, the Pinnacle CPA Review app is open to all accountancy students and graduates. Okay? Let's do this! This is the Pinnacle CPA Review app. Upon subscription, bibigyan namin kayo ng username and password. Ito yung gagamitin nyo to sign in. Okay? Basically, sa homepage natin, we have two major sections. We have subjects and we have updates and announcements. For the subjects, kompleto yung six sipali subjects natin. Pero hiniwalay namin yung problems and theory. So we have FAR problems, FAR theory, auditing problems, auditing theory, AFAR, MAS, RFBT, tax, and basic accounting. Okay? Kaya yung app na to is for everyone. Kahit first year or second year ka pa lang, pwede pwede sa ito. And also, this app has at least 11,000 quality questions. Updated lahat ng discussions and questions dito. For example, RFBT. Nilagay na namin dyan yung, let's say, cooperatives, PDIC, bank secrecy, AMLA, and so on. For tax, train law na lahat yun. Meron din tayong preferential taxation for tax, and we also have yung local government taxes. Lahat ng accounting standards, let's say, IFR 16 for leases, updated na rin to. Basically, kung ano yung nasa si policy labos, yun yung nandito sa app natin. Okay? Anyway, let's move on. Let's choose one subject. Let's say AFAR. Okay. And then, let's say Business Combi. Okay, you have three options. The lesson, you have the practice, and we have the exam. For the lesson, okay, basically, yung lesson is comprehensive discussion per topic. Alright? So, ayan siya. As you notice, yung ibang items dito, naka-highlight na yan, naka-bold na yan, para at least alam mo yung mga key points to remember. Okay, para mas magi efficient yung pag-review mo. And also, pwede pala yan naka-landscape view. Okay, so, depends sa preference mo. Pwede yung portrait, pwede yung landscape. Okay? And in the end, may mapansin mo, may illustrative examples din dyan. Okay? Para at least, gets na gets mo talaga yung topic. Okay? So, yun yung makikita mo sa lessons. Next, let's go to practice. Okay. For practice, um, papansin mo sa practice, we have here question and then meron tayong choices. Okay? For practice, every time na sasagot ka, makikita mo na agad yung solution sa baba. As well as, syempre, yung final answer. Okay? And the explanation. So, ganun yung for practice. Okay? Uh -huh. Next. Alright. Next. Okay. Uh, sir, paano yan may solving? Paano gagawin namin, sir, dyan? Oh, don't worry. Meron tayong built-in calculator. Okay? Okay. So, let's see. Times 9. Oh, nuwari lang. Tinitesting ko lang. Ha? Okay. Uh, sir, paano yan? Pag mahaba na yung solution namin, nakalimutan namin nilagay sa calculator. Worry no more. Meron tayong computation history. Okay, nandito lahat ng mga pinaglalagay mo sa calcul mo. Okay? So, nandito siya. Alright? Para maalala mo yung mga... Para ka nagko-compute lang. Ganito lang yan. Imagine mo nasa school ka, nagsasagot ka ng accounting exam. Ano ba kailangan mo? Siyempre, kailangan mo ng calcul, kailangan mo rin magsulat. So, yung experience na yun yung gusto namin i-replicate sa app. Kaya, we have a built-in calcul and computation history. Alright? So, ayan. Next... Ano natin? Try, try lang natin. First, puro C na lang sa sagot ko. Okay. Yan naman usually ang sagot mo sa exams mo, di ba? Ah, C, C, C. Okay. Ayan, C. And, okay. So, that's it. Let's move on to, ano yung next ng practice? Exam. Okay, exam. For exam, pwede natin lagay yung number of items. So, let's say 10 lang. And then, we have the timer. Okay. I-turn off na natin yung timer. Then, create. Alright? For exam, yung difference nito with practice is that hindi mo makikita yung sagot agad. Sa end mo pa makikita yung sagot. Okay? Para ka lang din nag-exam sa school. Alright? So, tingnan natin, ha? Aha. 
Okay? Obviously, may calculator ka pa rin dito. Okay? Accessible lagi yung calculator natin. Alright? So, test lang tayo. Ayan. Ayan. Okay. Alright. Okay. Submit. Oh, ayan. Oh, 3 out of 10. Oh. Alay mo, tumama pa ako ng 3 items. So, 30%. And then, yung gusto ko dito is, you have what you call exam summary. Okay? If you click that, makikita mo to. This is the exam summary. Papakita dito kung ano yung mga items na nagkamali ka and then yung tama ka. Obviously, yung mga red na yan, yun yung mga mistakes mo. Yung green naman, yung mga tama mo na sagot. Alright? So, if you double tap, oh, makikita mo yung question, yung answer mo, and then the solution. Okay? So, ayan. So, let's say for number 5, you answered A, pero yung tama sagot is C. And then, ito yung explanation. Got it? Okay. So, very helpful yung exam summary natin. Okay. Next is, we can also take mock exam. Alright? So, basically, mock exam is the simulation of the board exam. Para siyang pre-board sa mga review centers. It covers all the topics for that particular subject. So, in this case, yung AFAR. Okay? Same number of questions, actual boards, same time limit. Topics are equally represented. Basically, same format as the actual board exam. You can take as many as 10 sets of MAC exams per subject. Iba-iba yung questions. Okay? Basically, the objective of the MAC exam is for you to assess your level of preparedness in the actual board exam. Okay? So, ayan. So, in this case, uh, you have 3 hours and then 70 items. Alright. So, we can now exit the exam. Alright. So, let's go to... Okay. Let's go to the progress. Okay. We added an evaluation tool to measure your progress. We divided this into two parts. First one is basically the results of your MAC exams. Ayan. Yung goal mo dito is to get at least an average of 75% on all subjects and no grade below 65%. Okay? Obviously, bagsak na bagsak o 2% pa lang eh. Alright? And then, sa test naman... This one is the result of your exam per topic. Very useful because this will show you exactly kung anong specific topics ang strengths and weaknesses mo. Okay? Obviously, almost 0% pa lahat yan kasi hindi man ako masyado nagsasagot pa. Anyway, so let's say receivable financing, ano ka? Let's say 60% ka dyan. And then for inventory, 80% ka. Okay? Alam mo na kailangan mo mas mag-focus at mag-devote ng time sa receivable financing. Okay? This app is all about efficiency and effectiveness. Okay. All right. What else? FYI pala guys, ha? Uh, yung app na to, kahit data lang ang gamit mo, kahit hindi ka naka-Wi-Fi, mabilis pa rin yung app. Let's go to the next section which is updates and announcements. First one is updates on IFR syntax. For this one, we have updates for April 2020. Okay, we put the highlights here. All right. So for March and then we also have tax updates. For this one, ayan, meron tayong updates on si Tira Law. Okay? So, ayan. Through this app, you will have access to regular IFRS and tax updates. If you want to see the complete updates, click mo lang yung link. If you click the link, oh, ayan. Makikita mo na yung buong updates. Alright? Next is si Pali Updates. Okay, makikita mo dito yung PRC Announcements. For this one, nag-announce na ng schedule for October 2020 si Pale. Makita mo yung requirements, deadlines, room assignments. Again, to see the full details, click mo lang yung link. We also put here the table of specifications. So basically, yung syllabus natin para malaman mo yung maaaralin mo. And then, what else? We also put here si Pale feedback. Okay? So basically, makikita mo dito yung comments ng mga nag-take ng... 2019 si Pale, okay? Kung saan nag-focus yung BOA, etc. The goal is you learn from the past exams and from other students' experiences, then integrate mo yun sa review strategies mo. Okay? Now, habang nagpapahinga ka, kung gusto mo makarinig ng beautiful voice, uh, pwede kang ma-access ng Mr. Accounting dito. Play mo lang yung videos, alright? And, ayan, enjoy! 131250, okay? Plus okay. 131250. I'm just copying. Take note na available videos nandito yung Mr. Accounting lang. Okay? Again, the online review videos are available in our website. Okay, next. We also put here quick access on train law kasi maraming nalilito dito. Ayan, nilagay namin siya. 
salient points on three. Okay. And ayan. It's a train law. Next is what? Well, we have the revised corporation code. Uh, we put here the major points of the RCC. Okay. What else? Meron din tayo tax rates. Okay. Tax rates, siyempre, consistent with the, ano na yan, with the train law na yan. We have here the graduated rates. We have the final taxes. Percentage taxes. Ayan. So, for easy reference to you. Okay. Meron din tayo frequently asked questions on tax. Ayan. Lahat ng kailangan mo. We know that tax is the most challenging subject. Kaya naglagay kami ng mas maraming resources for tax. Alright. And then, next is references. Okay. Literally, lahat ng kailangan mo na references as accounting student, nandito na. IFRS, IAS, IFRIC, SIC, Exposure Drafts, ISA, GAM, Civil Code, Partnership, Corporate Code, PDIC, Bank Secrecy, AMLA, Intellectual Property, Electric Commerce, Le Electronic Commerce Act, Local Government Code, Revenue Regulations. So, click mo lang yung links. You will have complete access for each of these reference. Okay, marami pa ako hindi na mention. Okay, feel free to explore the app. Ay, marami pa ako hindi na mention of functionalities. Basically, yung pinakita ko sa inyo, yun yung major features of our Pinakel CPA Review app. I will give you three reasons kung bakit sulit yung bayad yun dito. Number one, we estimate that this app is equivalent to having at least 20 reference books. Imagine parang lagi may dalaw na 20 accounting books pero pwede mo i-access kahit kailan mo gusto. Ikaw na mag-compute kung magano matititin mo. Number 2 is convenience. Tuwing kailan ka ba nakakapag-aral na maayos? Pero pag nasa bahay ka, pag nasa school, pag nasa library, pero with this app, literally, makakapag-aral ka anytime and anywhere. Kahit nasa biyahe ka, naglalakad ka, kumakain ka, nakahiga ka, as long as may data or wifi ka, pwede ka mag-aral. Ang dali pang i-navigate ng app, makikita mo agad yung specific topics na gusto mong aralin unlike sa traditional books. Third reason is instant updates. Na-experience mo na ba bumili ka ng books and then years after, hindi mo alam kung magagamit mo pa kasi baka outdated na. I'll give you an example. Yung tax books na ginamit mo no undergrad, most likely hindi mo na yung magagamit because train lo na. Tama? Kailangan mo at least yung 2020 edition. Pero let's say ma-approve yung Citira Bill. Yung 2020 edition mo, obsolete na yun. Maghihintay ka naman ng 1 year para dun sa 2021 edition. Right? Pero with this app, instantly updated lahat. Whenever may new accounting standards, updates sa law, updates sa tax, hindi mo na kailangan maghintay ng 1 year, instant updates. Sir, paano namin niya avail yan? In 3 easy steps. Number 1, send us a message and then we'll send the instructions to you. Number 2, is the payment, pwede GCash or bank transfer. Number three, we'll send you your username and password. We have two types of subscriptions, pwedeng six months, pwedeng one year. May launching promo kami only for the first 300 subscriptions. We will give you discounts and one month extra subscription. So let's say nag-avail ka ng six months. Magiging access mo will be for seven months. Or let's say mag-avail ka ng one year, yung access mo naman will be for 13 months. Okay? We also have special discounts for the first year and second year students. We highly encourage you to prepare as early as now. By the way, our app is copyrighted, approved by the Intellectual Property Office last September 2019. If you are using the app, please do send us your feedback and suggestions. We would like to hear from you. We are committed to continually upgrade and enhance this app. If you think that the content of Mr. Accounting Channel is useful to you, I guarantee you, you have my words, that this app will also be a huge help to you. Whether you're first year, second year, third year, graduating students, or matalaga na graduate, if you're a practitioner, if you're a teacher, the Pinnacle CPA Review app is for you.